I'm breaking every single Roblox rule to try and get banned from the site as fast as possible. I'm not kidding. They recently updated their site rules, giving me more opportunities than ever before. And I said if I got 10,000 likes, I'd try it again. You can't impersonate individuals, groups, or entities in ways that may damage their reputation. So my name will be Taco Bell has poop meat. With that, I am slandering Taco Bell, hence damaging their reputation. Next rule I'm breaking is threats, bullying, and harassment. I am currently in Brookhaven, where I will find and bully random people. Stop dancing, freak. Oh. While I'm waiting for her response, I gotta say the rules I'm breaking in this video will slowly get worse and worse as the video goes on. Until eventually, hopefully, I get banned forever. Sorry, I don't take advice from a stupid their self because you're stupid and you would actually be nice if you were supported God. And I am nice and you don't support God and you can be a stupid gang. Oh my god. And, and then she just walked away. She walked away after that. She was done. <laughs> Illegal and regulated drugs. I have to make my own game to break this next rule. Let's put some drugs in this game. Ah, Bego Blunt. This specific item has gotten me banned multiple times in these challenges. I don't know why Roblox doesn't just delete it from the site. But hey, hopefully having this in my game will get me banned. And to increase the chances, I am duplicating it over and over and over. We'll add some needles just for good measure on the ground. Step on one of these bad boys and your life is about to change for the worse. There we go. Surely this is enough to get me banned. No sexually suggestive avatar bodies and clothing items. Now this next rule might be the most controversial one to break. I am officially wasting real life money on this video. 450 Robux. Let's look up Milky. Oh my God. Why are there so many stomachs? They all look the exact same. Why do people re-upload this so much? That must mean that it's like against the rules or something. So hey, I guess this belly will get me banned because apparently Roblox thinks that's breaking the rule. I'd say this was a worthwhile purchase. Threatening physical assault or violence. You. I will hit you really hard in the head with a big bat. I will stomp on you while riding a horse. I will grind you up in a blender. I don't care. I will take off your shoes and eat your toes. Weak. I will flip you upside down. I don't have any. You don't. You don't have any toes. Wait. No. No. I'm not. I'm not giving you a second chance. You just submitted to not having toes. Bye. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess that counts as threatening physical assault. Ban me for that, Roblox. Depicting dangerous physical challenges or stunts in the real world. So I guess I have to depict a dangerous stunt in this game. Whoa. This is certainly a dangerous stunt in real life. This rule is so dumb, man. <laughs> Why would this get me banned? It is depicting a dangerous stunt. I know, but why? Half your games are depicting dangerous stuff. Do you think doors is safe? <laughs> Dumb rule, but nonetheless, let's see if we get banned for it, I guess. Now that I'm a bit into the challenge, I could seriously get banned at any huh? moment. But let's move on to even worse rules. Like discrimination, slurs, and hate speech. Wait, 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 wait. I know that sounds bad. But for some reason, Roblox says you can't discriminate on people for age. It is literally the first thing they mention before race. I think that's a little more important than discriminating off age. I'll go ahead and write it in my bio underneath my beautiful avatar. You cannot friend me or play my games if you are 12 years old. Only 13 year olds allowed. See, isn't that a dumb rule? Isn't that stupid? That is now my official Roblox bio and apparently it could get me banned. You are not allowed to threaten to take over another's Roblox account. This is actually a very effective way to get banned. I have gotten banned for this in the past, so let's see how it goes. I am going to hack into your account. I will hack you and take over your account. Dude, he's running away from me backwards. He's horrified. Report me if you want. It won't stop me. <laughs> Look at him run away. He's scared. Yeah, I don't actually have to hack this guy to get banned. Apparently threatening is enough. Desecration of political entity symbols, including flag burning. So, I mean, I guess let's burn some flags in this game. Ah, the flag of Roblox. On fire! Someone put it out! No! Does this count as flag burning? I am burning a flag. That is directly stated as being against the rules. I'll go ahead and insert the US flag there too. I don't think Twitter will cancel me if I burn that. All right, I got some flag burning going on in this game. Apparently that's enough to get me banned, but only time will tell. Next rule, you're not allowed to direct users off platform. Basically meaning you can't tell them to go anywhere else but Roblox. And my friends have gotten banned for this. Caden just recently got banned for this. So let's update my profile a little bit. Display name, sub to laughability YT. Great, I am now directing users off platform. 
platform, but I can make it even worse. And what's that I'm typing in my bio? Subscribe. I like to ask at the middle of the video because by now you know if you actually want to subscribe or not. And you're not allowed to subscribe unless you're enjoying the video. I mean it. <laughs> All right, that's enough directing users off platform. Next rule. Romantic content. Basically, I gotta try and online date people. You. Hold my hand. Romance me. Okay. Wait, wait, you're actually doing it? All right, I, I, I guess we're, we're holding hands now. Yay. <laughs> I'm trying so hard to communicate to them, but it keeps on getting tagged. I like this horrifying creature that I have decided to online date. Come. Oh, hey, buddy. Dinner and a movie first. Well, while this guy leads me into his apartment, I'm going to go break the next rule. Recreating real-world sensitive events. And I'm just gonna take a seat in the meantime. Sensitive events like a bomb. Check out this bomb. I feel like there's been at least one sensitive event about a bomb. There's a model of John F. Kennedy. I'll give you three guesses as to what I'm gonna do to him. Ah, uh, boop. Is this too soon? Am I allowed to be making this joke? I mean, it is a real world sensitive event. I am just breaking the rules. Let's add some blood to the ground just to make it a little worse. All right, anyways, that's enough walking the line. Next rule. You are not allowed to upload bomb and weapon making instructions or schematics. Now they say you're not allowed to upload instructions on how to make a bomb, but they don't specify what type of bomb. If you think about it, it's instructions on how to make a bomb. I mean, I'm not wrong. Let me save this image. Yeah. Let me go ahead and screenshot this so I can save it. There it is. I am officially uploading it to Roblox and titling it Bomb Making Instructions. This will certainly not get me in trouble. How to make a cool bomb, a child safe. <laughs> and hey, well, that's uploading. Let's go back in game to break our next rule. Threatening to reveal others' personal information. You. What? I will reveal your personal information. I know it. Report me if you dare. Do it. Your name is Naomi. You live in Georgia. Nope. Okay, so I'm getting all of the information wrong, but I'm still breaking the rule by threatening to reveal it. I'll reveal all your personal secrets. You only shower once a week. Your biggest secret. Oh, okay. A police officer is coming up to arrest me. That's also cool, I guess. I'll come back later, but for now, let's break the next rule. Mass acts of violence against people or property. So mass acts of violence against people is easy. We just need to, like, put a bunch of dead noobs in here, and I guess that counts. Boom. Mass act of violence. Property? I guess I'll just, like, insert a building. Here's a building on fire. Fire. Boom! Mass act of violence against property. This is a dumb rule. I feel like lots of Roblox games have stuff like this in them. I don't know. Maybe Roblox will get mad at me for this in combination with everything else. But for now, let's break the next rule. Realistic modern firearms outside of inexperience items. The keyword here is outside of experiences. So this means if I upload an image of a realistic firearm, the site will ban me. This picture of a gun is circled with the word real on it. So I'll screenshot that, save it, and I guess I'll upload it to Roblox. I'll name it Realistic Firearm, just to trigger their systems. Dude, I'm scared. I feel like I'm really gonna get banned at any moment. This is where things really start to pile up. But now it's time to go back in-game to break our next rule. Profanity. Oh, great. I'm in a police car. This is an appropriate place to bypass curse words. That's right, bypassing curse words. I do it every video. It's very fun. I'll do it in front of this random innocent person. Dick. Badass. Same account launched experience from different device. Did I get banned already? No, surely not. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, I'm gonna refresh the page and uh, see what happened. Oh, oh my God, I got a warning for a realistic firearm. That's what got me a warning, uploading a picture of a gun. Oh my God, I did not expect to get a warning that quick for that. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. All right, new strategy. What if I just do that again? Are they gonna like ban me for real if I just do this? Same thing again. Name realistic firearm. This is a real gun, not an experience. Oh my god. I feel like this might actually seriously ban me. Well, fellas, let's see how it goes. I guess we'll move on from profanity and go ahead and break our next rule. Animal abuse and torture. Which sounds awful. But hey, Albert does it like every video and he's still up. So I'm gonna take a page out of his notebook and look up some animals to abuse and torture, apparently. Police dog. I'm just gonna go ahead and rotate you on your side. Add some blood underneath. 
with you and then put a knife there. I think that counts as animal torture. But just in case, let's add another animal into the mix. Just, just put a rat there. Boom. I think that's probably what Roblox was talking about. Next rule. I'm getting very close to the end now. I'm not actually breaking a rule with this one. I'm just doing a very important step in getting banned. Please report my account. I will hack you if you don't report me. I'm threatening people if they don't report me. What this does is actually bring your bad deeds to the attention of Roblox themselves through the report. So they can actually see like the chat logs of the bad stuff I'm doing and ban me for. Report me or I hack you. What are you talking about? That's exactly the reaction I want. No sweepstakes style game. I'm going to publish to Roblox as free Robux here. Lucky winner gets prize. Boom. Upload. And there we go. I've released it to the world and hopefully it'll get me banned. Now onto the very last rule that I do every single video. Abuse of employees. I will hurt. I will hurt builder man in the real world. I will flip him upside down and hit him like a piñata. I will slam him against the ground by his feet. I will spin him really fast until his face turns red and bursts. His toes are not safe. I will eat every last one. Watch out, Builder Man. Here I come. Anyways, I will check back with you in the future and see whether or not we are banned. See you then. Wish me luck. Hey guys, it's me back to show you the results. And look, we are not banned. We got away with it again. Roblox will never ban us. Long live Taco Bell has poop meat. We beat the systems yet again. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>